Welcome everybody to Central Valley Today. I'm Stephanie Bainham. Thank you so much for joining us. We certainly hope you all enjoyed the Valley's wonderful weather this past weekend. But while you're soaking up the sunshine, you might also start to notice more and more pests coming out to enjoy this warmer weather as well. So what do you do to prevent bugs from bugging you this spring and summer? Well, we're bringing in the pros to give us the answer. Please welcome John Painter. He's the field manager from Dustin Pest Control. Thanks so much for coming on. John, good to see you. Yeah, my pleasure. Thank you. And I noticed myself when I was lying in bed, I looked up at the ceiling and I saw some little critters and I was like, oh boy, it's that time. It is that time. <laughs> it, it is definitely that time. Um, you know, I mean, as it warms up, you're going to start seeing bugs. Bugs, you know, they're going to be looking for shelter, wanting in your home. And, yeah. Uh, I mean, they're, they're out there. They're not going away. So Right. So talk about the current conditions and the winter we just had. How does that contribute to the bugs? Well, I think, you know, with all the rain that we've had this winter, uh, moving forward as it warms up, it's going to be optimum breeding season for things like mosquitoes and gnats and, mm. and ants. You mm. know, you're going to have a lot, of, a lot of these bugs that maybe you won't see all the time. Uh, coming up very quickly right now. And I mean, why do they want to come in the house? Why aren't they happy outside? Well, they're all looking for, for food, water, shelter, just like you are, you know? I mean, <laughs> if, if it's hot outside, they want to be in where it's cool, you know? And uh, if it's wet, they want to go where it's dry. So yes. that's kind of the way bugs work. Okay. Well, so how can we help protect our homes and, and not see these creepy crawlers inside? I, I, I think the main thing for all pests um, and pest prevention is sanitation. Mm. You know, keep the leaf litter around your house cleaned up. Um, you know, trim your bushes. Uh, if you have an old tire holding water, dump the water out of it. You know, take away the breeding sources for the mosquitoes. Yeah. Um, flower pots and stuff like that, you know, same thing. Um, it, it, it basically boils down to sanitation as the biggest key for all pest prevention. Yes, and what are the experts saying about the mosquito season? What can we expect this year? It's gonna be bad. It's going to be bad. Yeah, it's going to be bad. Just plain and simple. Yeah, <laughs> it, I, I wouldn't expect anything different from last year. You know, last year we had a lot of them, and I think it's going to be pretty much the same this year. You yeah. Know, they're out there already. So. And like you said, we enjoy the rain, and, but so there's some standing water around. Exactly, yeah. I mean, you, you're definitely going to want to make sure you're doing your part as far as uh, mosquito prevention goes and, and dumping mm -hmm. out, you know, any any waters in old wheelbarrows or stuff like that around your house so you're taking away the, the yeah. you know, where the, the mosquitoes breed. True. Okay, so how can Destin Pest Control help all of us? Uh, so we, we offer a whole host of things. We have uh, normal monthly and bi-monthly general pest control services that we provide, but we also do mosquito control programs. We have some of those. Um, so, I mean, there's a lot, lots of things that we can do, you know, from rodents to termites to, yeah. I mean, you name it, we can... We can deal with it in some way or another. Okay, so you can sign up for monthly? Monthly and bi-monthly normal pest control. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, and and so some folks, they just have a yard where there's going to be some more mosquitoes. Yep, so if you have a yard with a lot of mosquitoes, we do offer a, a mosquito program where we do a perimeter treatment on the home. We also have these buckets that have some sachets in them that are, are laced with chemical, and it will help the, the population of mosquitoes in a hole. Oh, so. that's nice. And your neighbors will like you for it. Absolutely. <laughs> okay, and how about ticks? Ticks and spiders. I, I really can't stand them. Keep, keep, keep your grass short. Keep you know? the grass yep. short. Cut your yards, keep your bushes trimmed, you know, take away their, their harborage. Okay. Um, definitely, that's going to be uh, an area that's conducive to, to breeding ticks and, and fleas. And yes, and I know a lot of us love our animals. We got to check them for ticks mm -hmm. as well because they're outside sometimes. Yep. yep, definitely keep something on the pets, you know, some sort of uh, flea control on the pets. So that way when they do bring them into the house or if they get them in the yard and they come in the house, Ooh. then they die. Yes, Yeah. but know that they're outside. This is the busy season. How long does it take to get an appointment with you guys? And, and what's the time frame here? Uh, usually right now, this time of year, you can get one fairly quickly, probably in about a week. But as the season rolls on and bugs get busier, it gets harder and we mm -hmm. might be booked out a couple weeks. But. Okay. Well, it's time to book now. As you Absolutely. know, as John said, the bugs are getting busier mm -hmm. and we all want to enjoy our outdoor spaces and enjoy the insides of our home without seeing creatures, which I happen to be seeing right now. <laughs> so I'll be giving you a call. And what, what else? You're on Facebook and you've got email and um, your website. Yep. Facebook, email, and Google. Perfect. Well, Dustin Pest Control, thanks for coming on. And... We know now we're going to have a, a busy, buggy season, so you heard it here first, everybody. Get protected. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank